Modi has made today, where he has talked of an escrow account to commit to all the investors that all these incentives, 20% capital investment reimbursement, 100% state GST refund, uh, all IP filing costs, all testing costs being refunded, all of this, you won't have to go to government offices and uh, you know, really struggle for it. He's going to create an escrow mechanism, have a certification process which is free of official or political or bureaucratic interference and guarantee to investors that what he says will be delivered. And I think that's a huge message to investors. Congratulations, Chandrababu Naidu Garu. I'm sure under your leadership, Prime Minister Narendra Modi's vision, and I'll, I'll quote what he had said, it is my dream that everyone in India should have a smartphone, a drone in every farmer's field, and prosperity in every home. I think this vision of Prime Minister Narendra Modi will surely be fulfilled under the Swarna Andhra 2047 vision, working hand in hand with Prime Minister's Viksit Bharat 2047 vision. The two tall leaders, Prime Minister Modi, Chief Minister Chandrababu, two brothers working with the collective power of the people of Andhra Pradesh, working towards a bright and prosperous future for every child born in Andhra Pradesh. Congratulations, Sada Babu Garu. Congratulations to the people of Andhra Pradesh. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. And now I request our Honorable Chief Minister, Sri Nara Chandra Babu Naidu Garu, to address the... Honorable Minister, Sri Piyush Garu, Advisor to Government of Andhra Pradesh, Dr. Satish Ridigaru, another advisor to Government of Andhra Pradesh, Dr. S. Somanath Garu, one is space, one is drone, one is defense, one is futuristic technologies, and also ministers and the dias and friends. There is shortage of time. We are all busy. Already delayed the program. As Honorable Minister has rightly mentioned, it is a historical day. Government of India is announcing some program. We are adopting first more advantage. That is our uh, Honorable Prime Minister has announced quantum mission. Immediately, I brought quantum computer first in India, that to Amaravati. January, we are going to operate quantum computer in Amaravati. <laughs> Honorable Prime Minister has announced green hydrogen mission. Now, for green hydrogen mission, we declared green hydrogen valley, that is Andhra Pradesh. 500 gigawatts country is going to produce, in that 160 gigawatts of green energy from Andhra Pradesh. Now, because of green energy, data centers are coming, AI is coming. It is an excellent ecosystem we are creating. Government of India has announced deregulation space sector. Immediately I brought, I, I was in touch with Somanath ji. He is an expert. So he is making a reality near to Sri Harikota, next door, that a space city in Tirupati it is coming. I am confident. Already two, three companies are showing interest. With this conference, 
that uh, space city is full of entrepreneurs they are going to launch satellites for the global community if you see here very interestingly we are having two cities to develop it one is near bangalore that is r and d and also so many applications will develop in such side district near to bangalore r and d satellite prototyping and incubating space tech startups tirupati near sri harikota we are launching pad there we are going to develop component manufacturing satellite integration and launch logistics we are targeting 25000 crores investment 35000 jobs next 10 years recently i visited singapore i told you this is dubai they have taken to me to moon what is 2071 they have shown me now our somanath garu is here he will do better than dubai because they don't have technology all these things they are doing we are having everything we will prove it what is our space technology for the global community and also we are giving exemptions with provision stamp duty <coughs> waiver r and d grants and also we have created 100 crore space tech fund also this will give money is not the constraint according to me will get somewhere if there is no money my friend uh, piyush is here <laughs> <laughs> then i will uh, knock his door there is no problem at all another thing this is where drone city even recently our honorable prime minister also has announced drone city we are launching today this is where nigdik they have given some money we are make use of money that is where our over workallu you have given some money we are developing 300 acres we are year marking if necessary lot of land is available and also you can guide us we will take to the logical conclusion here advanced manufacturing world class testing certification facilities skilling of 25000 people remote pilots robust r&d and innovative networks public support with ease of doing business and crucially service enablement here drones we are thinking it is so many things tomorrow all wars will be through drones only that is going to happen already india has shown what is the power of drone recently and also civilian applications even pesticides application fertilizers even you can go for uh, mosquito control not only one or two surveys even soil mapping so many applications and also finally any transportation of cargo ultimately i am asking two honorable ministers are here high level powerful ministers one is investment minister piyush goel civil aviation ram mohan naidu i am asking them to give me permission to launch drone cars or taxis within 2 years time that has to be done that is a game changer to lay the road it will be very costly to use drone lot of space even civil aviation had a problem how to regulate i told him their department you are regulating as on today how you are regulating flights air traffic controller you put drone control traffic controller they will regulate every drone routes everything we will we are ready to launch that that is what i told him now they are convinced but execution is important i am very happy today you name any technology has to be in andhra pradesh all i tech either drone technology satellite 
quantum computers america is having silicon valley will have quantum valley that is the speed we have to move forward and also you know electronics we have to mobilize so many electronic devices we will go iot sensor cell phones everything will move in the direction aerospace again ram mohan naidu and industry industries minister here there is a lot of demand for flights even defense and everything that also we have to work it out these are all the areas even semiconductor even tomorrow robotics that is the order of the day today we are thinking tomorrow there is a population problem globally either you have to send people to that countries or you have to send robotics to that country that is the order of the day even countries like taiwan asking me to send people from india so this is a huge opportunity it is only the imagination is only the limitation everything is possible from now onwards you are going to see new things in andhra pradesh our honorable prime minister is doing extremely well if i say something earlier they used to ask me what is this i cannot follow i cannot understand now our honorable prime minister is saying if i do something i tell something he will add something you do it that is the target is giving so we are proud of him everything is possible everything i am imagining because of honorable prime minister he is a leader with vision and also he is a leader with a clear direction and also he is executing everything our friends all of you are here you have to do one thing either you have to use drone or be a pilot or produce drones that is what you have to do and space technology for everybody dubai recently they told me by 2071 that is uae formation day moon will send power to every home that is their vision now you had you can visualize what you are going to do it that is the order of the day everything is possible it is only imagination 20 years back you thought for for generation on your rooftop that is solar today your field can generate power that is the power so with all this thing, imagination is very important i am very happy 2025 visakhapatnam ca submit will create new history in high tech industry thank you thank you vanada thank you sir thank you very much Ladies and gentlemen, we now move on to the exchange of MOUs with the upcoming investors in Space City. And firstly, may I call upon Blue Eye Soft Corp and BES Space Private Limited, Mr. Shrikanth Kodaboyna, Managing Partner. Blue Eye Soft, along with BES Space, specializes in aerospace and space tech. driving advances quantum technologies and large scale infrastructure blue eye soft also excels in ai big data analytics and may i call upon next ethereal exploration guild private limited mr manu jainayar co-founder mr manu jainayar from ethereal explorations guild private limited upcoming investors in the space city they develop next generation launch vehicle technologies and advanced space systems congratulations and thank you next up exchange of mou with the upcoming investors of drone city allobotics private limited mr davlasai business team lead may i call you onto the stage please Mr Sai They specialize in autonomous drone systems and integrated technologies building full stack consoles and machine control platforms for multi drone coordination with seamless hardware and software integration Congratulations Next up may I call upon 
Aiken Analytic Solutions Private Limited, Ms. Janaki, founder and CEO. Hyderabad based startup specializing in AI powered drone analytics, manufacturing and RPTO certified pilot training. It serves defense industry, agriculture and logistics. And next up, may I call upon Aerospace Industries, Mr. Ravi Soni, Executive Director. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Thank you, Honorable Chief Minister. Thank you, Honorable Minister Sri Piyush Golji. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen.